quick tips and inspired topology optimization. This time around, shape control and just one of them, uh, symmetry. So symmetry just enforces the solver to put a optimization result which is symmetric. Okay, as easy as that. Um, what does that mean and how to set it? Um, you have here the shape controls and two shape controls are available in Inspire right now. So you have the symmetry and the draw direction. And the symmetry lets you then choose between symmetric, uh, cyclic, so for rotary, rotary uh, symmetric uh, things, and also cyclic symmetric, where you have a rotary symmetry, but also a planar symmetry on your rotation. And um, yeah, so the easiest one to, of course, is uh, symmetric. So you just click on that and then click on your design space. And what this will do, it will just highlight, in this case, three planes of symmetry, which are all active. Red, in this case, means active. And you can click on them to deactivate, like so, for example. In the demo model, I think this is the um, solution which is, which is there, which enforces that you have a symmetry with this plane and with this plane. So that means... Every part here must be mirrored to this side, and every part here must be mirrored to this side. So this would be a completely symmetric model here. Of course, this might, doesn't make much sense because also the design space is not really symmetric. So yeah, you could not really do stuff um, quite effective. So like this. And what comes out from the optimization, you can look at it. So this is the result, and as you can see, it's symmetric. Um, bear in mind that if you have just a normal mesh, the mesh is not symmetric and it will maybe struggle to be 100% symmetric. But um, yeah, it enforces to be uh, symmetric in general. Another way um, of doing symmetric models is to just, um, if you have symmetric boundary conditions, you can cut the model and then introduce a symmetric boundary condition. But this is for another time. I just want to mention it here. And um, yeah, that's all for today. Thanks and have a good one.